This was supposed to be an unboxing video of my new book Ancient Manifestation Secrets but it all went tragically wrong. Let me tell you about it. So I've been waiting for the copies of the book for the past month. I've been getting emails from the, the customs like service. They were asking for my address. The address was wrong and then they wanted a valid telephone number. So I'm like back and forth. Here's my address. Here's my telephone number. When am I going to receive my copies? It's been going on and on and on dragging. And then yesterday I get an email saying finally cleared. You should expect your books tomorrow. I'm like, yay, waking up in the morning, expecting the books, just going to the gym and being worried if I'm not home to like uh, for the delivery, eventually arrived home. And then I hear the doorbell ring and I'm like, yes, the books are here. I'm so excited. I go and I see the UPS guy. I'm like, great. I open the door, he comes up. And by the way, I'm expecting around 50 books. So at least two or three boxes of books. And then I open the door and I see this, just this little box. And I feel the disappointment washing over me. I'm like, oh, it's not the books. It's probably this clothing order I placed like last week. So I just place the box on the table. I go to the kitchen, I get a knife. I like tear up the tape. I open the box and <gasps> I gasp because it is actually the copies of the book. For some reason, they only delivered seven copies. I had like 50 like in order, but I got seven of them. So never in a million years did I think that these would be the actual copies. And then I get the copy of the book and I stare at it in shock. And then I start laughing hysterically, <laughs> like giddily, just laughing because it just hit me. I have been working on publishing this book since at least 2020. I mean, I wrote it in 2021, but the idea probably like came to me in 2020 and it's been so long. How many years now? 20, 20 like four years. Yes, it's like almost five years, almost five years. I've been trying to manifest this book. I mean, it's a book about manifestation and I, and I manifested it with the process that I teach about in the book, So Meta, right? So, I'm gonna show you the book because I'm so excited. And then I'm gonna tell you all about it. So, here it is. Isn't it gorgeous? It's almost as colorful as me. <laughs> I love it. Like, check it out. It's just so beautiful. I'm so excited. <sighs> here it is. Okay, so let me tell you all about ancient manifestation secrets. So. In 2021, I booked myself a trip to Delphi in Greece and I booked a cottage for 10 days and the idea was to go there, relax, connect with God Apollo and channel this book. I had already written a lot of it, but I wanted to finish it there. So the idea was to go with my best friend to Athens and spend a couple of days in Athens and then I would go to Delphi by myself. So. I arrived to Athens at the airport and I realized that I had forgotten my luggage at the airport in Cyprus, as people do. Like, why would this happen, especially to me, being a control freak? I forgot to have my coffee in the morning, so I go there, I go through the security check, and I forget the luggage at the security table, and I leave, I get on the plane, and while the plane was taking off, I had the epiphany, I don't have my luggage with me. <laughs> Panicked, I told the, the flight attendant, she's like, there's nothing we can do, you have to wait until we land to Athens. So I landed in Athens, I called the airport, there was no way they could send it to me. So I just went shopping for like the basics, but that meant that essentially the gods had a divine plan for me. That meant that I couldn't distract myself with anything else. All I could do was be in my little room at Delphi facing the temple of Apollo from my window and writing every single day and every single night. 
And it was such a magical journey of allowing myself to receive the information, to channel the processes and then put them into practice. And I've been practicing these practices for the past four years with huge success. The journey continues because as soon as I had written the book and I pitched it to my publisher, my publisher rejected it saying that it's too advanced and it's best if you write another book first and then follow up with this one. So that's how I conceived the idea and I wrote Secrets of Greek Mysticism, my book that came out in April. Like a more, not basic, but a more introductory book about the Greek gods and goddesses and the, the ancient Greek religion. But I'm like, you know what, I'm not going to let a publisher dictate when I will publish a book. That's just not me. <laughs> My motto in life is, and I learned this from Kris Jenner, if someone says, no, you're talking to the wrong person. So I started pitching the book to different publishers and then eventually the right publisher for this book showed up. And that's why this year I have two books that came out. Secrets of Greek Mysticism that came out in April and Ancient Manifestation Secrets that comes out in November. And that is the whole story of how this book came to be. So you can see why I was so, like so touched when I held a copy of this book in my hands because that was a five year journey in the making and finally being here holding the physical copy in my hands. It is the best feeling for an author when you finally get to hold your creation in your hands. Like these are, my books are my babies. They are my children, they are my family. It's my legacy, it's what I love doing and what I love creating and what I love putting out into the world. And I'm so excited to share this book with you. It presents a brand new process of manifestation. It's all about manifesting with the energy field. It talks about planting your desires in your energy field, connecting them with frequencies, with spirit guides, with people, with organizations to support the manifestation of this book. It's not about solely depending on the universe. It's about collaborating with the universe. It makes the claim that the law of attraction is not the most powerful law in the universe and teaches you how to work with the seven manifestation laws of the universe to manifest your desires in a more pragmatic way. In the book, I also make the claim that you cannot manifest all of your desires and you shouldn't want to manifest all of your desires because there are desires that are aligned with your life purpose and those desires are way more easy to manifest than any other desire that comes from your ego. So I teach you how to find your life purpose and how to choose desires that are aligned with that purpose, all in a five-step process. And then at the end of the book, I have a 10 day challenge to manifest a specific desire. So let me just give you like a walkthrough of the book. Let's talk about the, the chapters. First of all, there is a foreword by my good friend, one of my best friends and manifestation queen, Emma Mumford. So I was so grateful to have Emma write the foreword for the book. So the book is divided into three parts. Part one is called the seven laws of the universe and that refers to the hermetic laws of the universe written in the book the Kibalion. and the laws are the law of mentalism the law of correspondence the law of vibration the law of polarity the law of rhythm the law of cause and effect and the law of gender then we go into part two which is all about living the laws and in this part i introduce my five step process to manifestation. Step one, raise your vibration. Step two, clarify your desires. Step three, release your limiting beliefs. Step four, nurture the energy of your desires. And step five, take inspired action. It's quite of a revolutionary process because it goes against the order that other teachers teach. And there's a very specific reason behind that that you'll read about in the book. And then part three is the 10 day manifestation challenge where we take the processes of the book and we apply them in a 10 day challenge to manifest a specific desire. Oh, I am so excited for you to read this book. 
make sure to go to ancientmanifestationsecrets.com to get all the details. When you get the book, you also get a free workshop with me, a past life regression workshop where I'll regress you to your past lives where you had already mastered manifestation and help you retrieve those manifestation skills in your current life. It's a very um, powerful workshop. My past life regression workshops are usually my most loved ones by people. So I know you're going to love that one as well. So ancientmanifestationsecrets.com. Of course, the book is available anywhere books are sold, both online and offline. So, sorry for this failed unboxing. I had already unboxed it, but here it is. I'm so excited for you to read it.